Zelda, all Zelda for me when he played uh, Violet and Joker. I thought he was all Gavin. Uh, two, uh, two, one, fake eight. Uh, what's that? What's that? Eagles. Yeah, guys, you guys are doing it. You got to start. Like Patrick, the entire time. Who did he play? And then he played, uh, uh, played uh, D &D. The whole time? Yeah. Who took game one? Uh, I took game one, he took game two, I took game three. Okay. Game one, my Kirby beat is Jake Game two of his Terry beat my Kazooie. Right? And game three of my Kirby beat Zippy What the fuck? <laughs> Who's this set, bro? Uh, no. Okay, we're well, down. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, RJ and Salt Lake on an open setup. I'm 2.0 on this
Mm. Going back to PS2. I feel like that's a solid choice. Let's go both players, that's right, do we? A little bit of pummel probably could have took the stock there. Slight favoritism, but he used to support both players. Yeah, Robin's aerial smash attacks are just super crazy. Ooh, this is gonna be a stock, no doubt. Sunny taking a pretty big lead here. <laughs> Donna kind of just keeping her distance, looking, just waiting for the opening to kind of let Rip get some percent going. Doshan kind of struggling to really find the opening to get in. <laughs> see a back throw here. Gonna see possible ledge trap. Oh, oh, oh. That is a rock paper scissors moment if you did not know. Uh, attacks do beat grabs. If you grab and attack at the same time, the attack will beat the grab. <laughs> Wolf Wolf Smash is really, really good. Alright, still with some life. Not quite gonna take the stock. Ooh, the air dodge. Not, not a super hard punish. So trying kind of... Kind of struggling to take the second stock here. He's been overlapped. He's really not in a good situation. Sitting at disadvantage. So any good smash attack right now from Wolf will definitely take the stock. And the back air most definitely will take the stock. Oh, the whip grab, but no up smash punish from Wolf. Oh, the roll. Getting caught by down smash. Robin's down smash does cover both sides, so he did have that option select. But the question is, is can Joe Shine make the comeback? He's got a big uphill battle to go. The F tail gonna take that stock. We're seeing game three. So. Yeah. What you got? Uh, to uh, me, Saul played all healing, I played Joker, and then DK. 
No peaches. I so there's an open setup. Uh, I don't know who they want to call for stream, that's the problem. Is there like a, a stream TO available? What you got? The men moment. What you got? I got to the men. Came on the men. Came on I went banjo and jokers. And it was 2 0. His favorite? His favorite. His favorite. It's an unplayable matchup. I will work on Neil and Neil, though. Hey, man, that's the only thing you can do. Um, do y'all know if this is something we can call a wreck, wreck and bake day? Are they like trying to wait for stream or can I call it? I think you can, I think you can probably call it. Okay. Um, Sketchy's playing with Laura and I'll do it for a uh, wreck and bake day? Requiem? Bake eight? Use gun. Can I get y'all on an open setup? If you just down gun around on Hogger, she can't do shit. Baked ape? Baked ape? Okay. Alright, sorry, we're submitting some scores, but uh, Light Ships taking intro, true. RJ played Pizza and Stream and on Twitch Prime. So, oh, I'll let him know. I'll let him know. Okay, so I was doing some scores, so I, I missed like the first minute and ten seconds of this match. But looks like Joe Shine has switched to, uh, to Shulk, which I guess this isn't bad versus Wolf with that big sword. Um, and we're on small battlefield, so I, I could see this being pretty doable. But he's got a pretty tall hill to climb right now. He's at 166 versus Wolf at 65. And Wolf is really unforgiving. It, it's kind of hard to find her punishes versus Wolf. You're really gonna have to get a ledge trap or an edge guard. That that dash attack probably would have killed regardless, but he did DI pretty pretty in on that. So Joe Shine, he's sitting at eleven percent. He's looking for a little, a little something something to get started up. He definitely wants to get like something with like smash or just get a kill, kind of get it started up. He doesn't want to get too far behind a precision. And the dash attack crossing up shield. I don't think he was ready for that. He was looking for an up smash out of shield, but I don't think he realized that Wolf's dash attack does cross up shield. Trying to get the edge guard too. He didn't get it, but he did manage to hit Wolf with the up special through the stage. So he's a little bit in advantage state right now. So it is working out. Just not able to kill Wolf though. Oh. Yana kind of running away with the stock a little bit. Oh my god, yeah, that was a huge call out for Sunny. It looked like, uh, was that forward throw, back throw? And kind of just knew they were, I don't want to say it was a panic jump, but probably just double jumping to try to get out of disadvantage. She really called it out with the back air. And Wolf back air, it's, it's strong. Alright, we're in shield art, trying to get back into advantage state here. Yeah, he took game one. So Joe Sean, he's, he's got a really, really tall hill to climb right now. He's gonna have to really, really take this stock, no doubt. And then maybe possible edge guard or something, you know, he's gonna have to try to well, With that being said, Sonny takes it. Oh, definitely, definitely. He's, he's a hard character to, to get the, the edge versus after you're down. Uh, I 